Welcome back to the School of Calisthenics with Tim and Jacko. And today we're talking ring muscle ups, but specifically, we're gonna give you guys that are struggling just to nail down that last little piece of getting from below the rings to above the rings. We call that a transition and it can be the hardest part of the muscle up to nail down. Yeah, it's tricky. A lot of us stay stuck behind the rings and we're not thinking about how do we transition and change that pull into a push. But today we're gonna to solve that problem for you. So check out the video coming up. The ring muscle up transition is obviously the trickiest bit of the muscle up and it might be that you've done some work through that transition with the band working as a cradle but when you take that thin band away you still find yourself stuck behind the rings you feel like you're pulling high enough you're getting your thumb to your chest but you just can't get through and it might be because we're not thinking about the change in force application from a pull into a push for that transition so we'll just Tim will give you an example of what might be happening you might be pulling and getting stuck behind the rings so you can't go out. You, the rings are sort of turning a bit and you're not getting yourself through. But when you use a little thin red band, you do get through. And that's partly because the ring, the band will be giving us some assistance in terms of helping us get up there. But the other thing that it's doing is once you've pulled, the band is helping support you up so that you can just transition straight forward. When you take that band away, you're not pushing down into the ring once you've finished your pull. So as well as getting yourself forward between the rings, we need to think about changing that force application from pushing, uh, from pulling up to pushing down. You don't turn the rings on purpose. As you push yourself through, the rings get turned in that process, but you must make sure you've changed that force application from a pull. As we come through, we're pushing down into the ring to get yourself through that transition. Obviously, Tim's first demonstration was super, super slow. When you're going for the first time, it's going to be a little bit faster, but we do need to teach the brain that this transition forward and changing from a pull to a push requires us to change that application of force into the ring, and that is going to get you redefining your impossible of your first muscle up. We hope that's helped you with your muscle up goals and gave you some ideas of things that you can work on to help you with those muscle ups. Please like this and share it with any friends that are also working on their muscle ups. And then if you've got any other sticking points or problems with those muscle ups that you want to help with, let us know in the comments. And if you want to take a bit of a deeper dive into your muscle up training, we've got a completely revamped and enhanced course for both the ring and bar muscle up in our online training platform, our virtual classroom. Fully backed by training science and years of strength and conditioning coaches working with loads of people to teach them to successfully get above the bar or above the rings. And we would love it if you'd go and check it out. Class dismissed. Okay.